happen though. It's uh, getting to be about sunset, so it's probably uh, some colors. Uh, of note in the sky, there might even be some gray, <laughs> gray and white colors right behind me. How you doing, buddy? We're over here at the uh, start of a labyrinth. There you are, Saki. And uh, the altar at the center of the labyrinth there uh, marks uh, the point of view by which we can uh, see the labyrinth stones at the edge of the pond. And um, maybe I'll just walk you over. Anyway, I place these here. Uh, to mark the equini, the uh, spring and autumnal. Uh, so that's looking east, and so the sun rises here uh, between these two through the year. So uh, it'll rise here, and then all along here until it rises here, and then it'll rise here, 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 here. here. When it rises here, and so from the point of view of inside the labyrinth, uh, that's where the sun rises. And uh, it's the uh, spring equinox today, so I thought uh, I'd walk the labyrinth or some part of it, depending on how cold it gets or how the signal is, I suppose. <coughs> so I think I'll set the camera up here. This is uh, the camera now facing east, so it's maybe not ideal. Uh, uh, let's see if that has any hope of wanting to stay. I really don't know what the odds are. <laughs> so precariously balanced on this old birdhouse here. I'll try another spot. I feel like we should do a making of sometime. As you can see, you won't believe how it's balanced. <laughs> I, I know the sky's tilted, but uh, well, I could try it this way and see. This may very well fall on the earth here. Yeah, the equinox is uh, when the equator of the Earth passes through the center of the sun, leaving the most all of the Earth, I guess, are uh, experiencing equal parts uh, day and night, uh, or nearly equal, and so it's this kind of day of a balance of. Uh, it'll become more yang or more yin on either side of the equinox. And so it really feels like it, it sort of comes from the two words equal and night, you know, so. And I think there was one that was like equal thought or equal something like that, equal lux or maybe. Uh, that, you know, the same idea with equal light. Uh, and so it's a really sort of yin yang day. Here comes Saki already in the labyrinth. How you doing, buddy? So I'm going to go to the far side and enter the labyrinth and I'm going to just walk it with a sense of uh, equal poise and uh, uh, sort of a heightened awareness of uh, balance. He's right here at my feet. So you want to walk the labyrinth with me?
trying to tune into how those equal parts border and path, those equal parts left turn and right turn, those equal parts kind of going the direction I feel like is forward, and then of course there's equal parts going backwards. Thank you for joining me, yeah. There's also equal parts walking on the sod and walking on the brick. Doc is doing the brick walking. Go the way you want to go. Yeah, you just guys told me. That way? Okay. Yeah, that's what I'll do. I'm going to get the camera. Normally, we'd reverse, come out of the labyrinth, but he's ready to go in. And that's okay. So there's the labyrinth. There's the cat, who I'm imagining will hurry up. He's ready to come in. You wanna come in? Come on. Hurry up. Come on. Come on. We're gonna move on. Come on. Come on. Here he comes. Yeah. 
okay thank you all